Hello fellow comic book lovers, collectors, and aficionados, Vin Crew here with his most recent comic book haul. Uh, I got a lot of books that I picked up in the last couple of weeks, so got to get cracking, but it's going to mostly be a couple of small shows I went to, really tiny shows. There were like three or four comic book vendors at each one, um, and some IG stuff, some eBay stuff, high, half price books, that sort of thing. So, uh, like I said, got a lot to go, so we're going to just get started. Um, I'm going to start off with the books that are for sale and are trade. So these are all doubles that I picked up. Star Wars number one, this is Marvel's volume two, the Scotty Young variant. Green Lantern number 30, the Mad variant, the coveted Sinestro Peen in the Snow. Uh, Batman 497, Breaking of the Back. Uh, Spawn number 9, First Appearance of Angela. Spawn 117, Walking Dead 100, the McFarlane variant. El Zombo Phantasma number 1. This is the first pro work of Dave Wilkins. <clears throat> uh, Spider-Man, Black Cat, number two. Scarlet Witch, number three, out of the AHA. Uh -huh. Is this Faction AHA? Uh -huh. I can't remember. I think this is a David AHA uh -huh cover. Uh, Dollman, number one. <clears throat> uh, House of Mystery, 206. I think this is a Wrightson cover. It really looks Wrightson-ish. Is that's a word with those kids there. Uh, Liberty Comics with uh, Hellboy on the cover. Uh, Grim Fairy Tales Halloween Special, X Uncanny X-Men 207, kind of a classic uh, JRJR JR cover, Lobo 33, Lobo 17, Sin City uh, homage, uh, The Darker Image, uh, I'm picking these up. First supposed appearance of Max, for sure Blood Wolf, and uh, I can't remember the other one, but a couple of those. And then I found the gold variant. Uh, Max number one. Max two out of the Wizard giveaway. Marvel Comics presents 85. This is the first appearance of Cypher, I believe, and first interior of... Um, uh, oh. Oh, I forget the guy's name. One of the bigger artists. Um, Marvel Comics Presents 95. I believe this is the origin of uh, uh, Wolverine's helmet. Gen 13, number 12, J. Scott Campbell. Another J. Scott Campbell, Gamora Swimsuit Special. I Hate Fairyland, number 1, J. Sc or, uh, Scotty Young. Nom, number 23, Good Girl Cover. X-Men 184, First Appearance of Forge, Masters of the Universe, number five, Spineless Man 2099, one of those uh, spoof books, those uh, parody books, uh, Detective Comics, number one, Second Print, First Appearance of the Dollmaker, where he cuts off Joker's face, um, Uncanny X-Men 139, Kitty Pride joins the team, Free Comic Book Day, Spider-Man, Like I said, these are all for sale and or trade. So if you're interested, just reach out to me. If not, they'll be in the next support comic book attic sale. Uh, Deadpool, Mark with a Mouth, number nine. The Graduate Homage. Green Arrow, 41. Joker variant. Batgirl, 14. Art Germ cover. The uh, Monsters uh, Homage. Hell Blazer, 27. DC versus Marvel, the DC Universe variant, number four. Uh, Wolverine 27, a Jim Lee, kind of a classic cover. Ad Captain Adam, number one, first appearance of Captain Adam. Uh, it's been on a first uh, few top 10 lists. Um, Detective 42 out of the new 52, the Teen Titans Go variant. Rocketeer, the prestige format book, Dave Stevens cover. Uh, Swamp Thing 46, I believe this is, has to do with Justice League Dark. Um, the uh, Black Flash uh, series here, 1 through 3, 139, 140, and 141. Sleepwalker, number 1. Captain Marvel, number 1. The Monica Rambo, uh, uh, Captain Marvel. Batman, uh, I can't remember what number this is. I want to say 126. I'm probably wrong on that. Uh, this is the variant with uh, that 
homages. Is it Spider-Man 316? I believe. Yeah, it is 126. Uh, Supergirl. Um, DC Universe number four. Man of Steel 28 DC Universe. Flash 104 DC Universe. Flash 90 DC Universe. Clive Barker, Son of Celluloid, uh, the Marilyn Monroe cover. Evil Knievel, one shot. All right, still more doubles here. Uncanny X Men 222, uh, the Sabretooth uh, Wolverine fight. Um, first appearance of uh, Bishop 282 of uh, Kenny X-Men, um, the variant to Wolverine Weapon X number one, Wolverine versus Hulk number eight, just another Wolverine Hulk battle, uh, first appearance of Onslaught X-Men 53, uh, another Onslaught book here, I don't know what this is, uh, 54, um, first appearance of She-Dragon, uh, um, Savage Dragon versus Megaton Man, Fem Force Fright Book with uh, Frankenstein. G.I. Joe 18, just an awesome uh, Baroness cover. G.I. Joe European Missions number two. Uh, G.I. Joe number 12. This has the Invincible preview. One, two copies of that. Airboy, kind of an awesome cover with Valkyrie on it. Authority Zero. <clears throat> Uh, Adam Hughes cover, Sensation Comics, number four. Invincible, 85. Invincible, 103. I like Invincible on Amazon. It's a good show. Uh, first appearance of Dead Girl, I believe this is. 116 X-Force. Uh, another Adam Hughes, Wonder Woman, 150. Uh, 145, Adam Hughes, Wonder Woman. Uh, 146, Adam Hughes. Legion of Superheroes, number, I can't remember what it is, two something. This is the Amethyst preview, 298. Um, the last issue of Sandman, number 75. Batgirls, first, uh, this is that Future's End one shot. It's the first appearance of... Uh, this new Batgirl, forget her name, uh, Vampirella Strikes, Michael Turner, uh, Jenny Frizen, Vampirella, Wolverine at number one, out of his first ongoing, uh, Spider-Man 2, first appearance of Evil, Miles Morales, Marvel Super Heroes, this is the one that extends the M Captain Marvel uh, book. Uh, warp number five, first appearance of, uh, oh my God, what the heck is his name? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm brain farting that one too. Um, but it's a first appearance of somebody. Somebody will put it in the, the comments, I'm sure. Donatello, Donatello, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, number three. Um, Micronauts, number one. Newsstand, first appearance of Bug. Uh, Sinister House of Secret Love, number one. Beautiful Neil Adams cover. Joker, number one. Cool, cool book. Uh, Deadpool, 67 with Dazzler. Dazzler's hot right now. Pro, number one. First print. Savage Dragon, 33. 103. These are all really low print books. Uh, 101. 112. One of these has uh, Invincible, I think. Um, 109, 108, and this one, yeah, this one has Invincible, 107, and 106. Getting close here. Okay, so this finishes up the last of the doubles. So these are once again for sale and or trade. 
X-Force Magazine. This reprints uh, first appearance of Deadpool on uh, New Mutants 98. Uh, Wailing Blade number one, the Hulk 340 homage. Oxymoron number one, uh, the McFarlane Spider-Man homage. Batman Girl number one, Adam Hughes. Batman Adventures 15. Fantastic Four 273, first Nathaniel Richards. Batman Annual 25, second print, way better cover in my opinion. This is the origin of Red Hood. The Thing 2035, excuse me, first appearance of the, um, this Miss Marvel. Emperor Joker, one shot. And Super Bad James Dynamite, number one. So that's everything that's for sale and or trade. So if you're interested in any of those, let me know, like I said. All right, so moving along to the stuff that is staying in the collection. All right, let's see what we got here. All right, so this is Justice League number 207 i believe it is 217 the reason i picked this up is that th you can tell right here with the classic and then the so much fun it's a so much fun variant hard to find these these were given away in multi-packs not given away but sold in multi-packs um this harley quinn uh bruce tim variant flash 96 dc universe logo uh, Adventures of Superman 517 DC Universe, Batman Detective 700 DC Universe, Aquaman 3 DC Universe, Flash 87 DC Universe, Detective 871, excuse me, DC Universe, 670 DC Universe, Supergirl 3 DC Universe. Trying to get all the DC Universes. There's well over 550 of them, so it's tough. Um, Savage Dragon 104, I believe this is. Saying in the collection, or 114, I'm sorry. Um, Mortal Kombat Raiden and Kano number three. I like picking up these Mortal Kombat books. Um, first appearance of the that cat that's uh, I believe this is, and Miss Marvel Giant Size. I never own this, so I guess why not? Um Killer Cult, this is, oh my gosh, I don't even know what number this is, number, I don't know, number one, um, so, yeah, um, the Spider-Man Ash Can, I thought it was really cool, so I had to grab it, and then with Green Goblin too, um, this beautiful X-Men Black variant, uh, Magneto, Grab that. This a lot of these, especially with the ones with these little blue things on them, came from comics for sale on Instagram. Been buying a lot from him. He he does some fairly he does some really pretty good deals and and burns out uh, blows out some books. So uh, thank you so much for those. Uh, Deadpool twenty eight, the Venomized uh, cover, Hotel Hell number one. Um. Savage Dragon 163, Amazing Spider-Man 799 variant, awesome looking Green Goblin, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy 146 variant, kind of that uh, uh, Infinity Gauntlet kind of thing, uh, another spoof comics that I've always wanted, Goat Rider versus M Mubius, um, picked up a bunch of, I think these are either, yeah, one in 200s. They're one in 200s. I was going to say one in 150s or uh, one per store or something. So, but Green Lantern, number six, number seven, number eight, and number nine. Uh, Vampirilla, just really like this cover a lot. I don't even know who did the cover, to be honest. I'm not sure who that is, but it's apparently signed. So I liked it. Definitely color cover buy on that. Um, Vampirilla, another one. I got to do some research on the cover. Um, almost Chiodo esque uh, in some way. It kind of reminds me. So that's the reason I grabbed it. Uh, Tomb Raider number two out of Journeys. Uh, Adam Hughes cover. 
Harley Quinn variant to number 75. Is this Shannon Mayer, I think, that did this cover? Um, Original Sin number three, this beautiful Black Widow cover. This book isn't worth anything. I couldn't believe it. I was just, this I got off eBay and I was just Googling through it. I saw this. I was like, man, I, I remember this when the Avengers came out and God, this book was hot. Now it's worth nothing. It's worth like five bucks. <laughs> just shows you, I guess, huh? All right. Okay, picked up some more Maxes. I'm trying to complete the Max and Pit Run. Max especially, because that, that book's, that series starting to garner some interest now, since there, there's talks of rebooting it somehow. So here's 32, it ended at 35. So uh, issue 30, um, finally got this first appearance of the goat <laughs> from Quantum and Woody. I've always wanted this book. I always thought I'd find it in a while, but never did. Uh, Popeye, just a uh, cool looking cover here, classic comics. These came from that Comics for Sale still too. This is not a 1 in 100, even though he says it is. There's two variants in this in this uh, run here, Justice League of America. One of them is a 1 in 100. It's a seven page gatefold uh, cover, which uh, 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 connects all these covers, but it's still a beautiful Jim Lee cover, so I'm not too disappointed. Um, uh, Savage Dragon 113, Exiles number one, the Wolverine Appreciation variant, Star Wars Early Adventures, just this cool uh, Boba Fett, um, X Lives of Wolverine number one variant, just a Hulk 181 homage. Thundercats 23. Is this second to the last issue, maybe? Um, the Teen Titans very uh Teen Titans 15. This is a uh combo pack variant, I believe. This combo pack. It's either combo pack. Yeah, I think it's combo pack. I can't remember. Uh Amazing Spider-Girl number 30, just a great cover. Uh, what is this? Sorry. Venom 2099. Now, this is actually Spider-Man 2099, but towards the end of the run, they did these variants. Some would say Spider-Man 2099 on them, and then some would say Venom 2099. So I'm trying to get the Venom ones to finish. I already have the complete run of Spider-Man 2099, but looking to just fill in these Venoms. Uh, this book surprised me. G.I. Joe 266 book. Um, I was looking, there's some sold ones for as much as 15 bucks. So um, I, I grabbed it for the, I think he was charging four bucks for it. Uh, God of War number two. Legacies number one variant. Beautiful looking cover. Uh, another Psycho Killers um, I don't remember what number this one is. Uh, this is a series I'm trying to collect to. Number four, uh, Savage Dragon 105 and 111. Savage Dragon, I'm trying to finish that set too. Um, Marvel Knights 2099, it's a prestige format. Um, I just grabbed it, it was like two dollars. I'm gonna do a little research, it's probably a big uh, nothing burger, but I, I couldn't tell if this was Daredevil or Deadpool on the cover. I still think it's Deadpool or Daredevil, um, but yeah, cool. It's prestige format so two bucks i didn't think i'd lose much on it and then plus i got money off of it still i never pay what uh dealer asks a lot of these now are from the show that i went to uh this is j obar pink dust morphine dreams um these uh j obar books are starting to see some you know when high tides uh you know uh 
rising tides raises all ships kind of a thing and that's what these james obar books are starting to see a little bit of uptick because of the crow stuff uh spook house only grabbed it because it was signed here i believe it's by eric powell um uh grab this set here of the plot i just love this uh homage to um the first swamp thing powerless another homage to giant size x-men one scud 16 spider-man dark hawk nova and speedball friends and enemies number three i like these little mini series vampirilla um number one art germ um one in 20 i believe this is um this i picked up i finally broke down bought this book off of my comic shop this is venom 14 out of the max uh the um uh, Sam Keith, excuse me, the Sam Keith Sliver run. And this is the last one I needed. And this book has some, some, um, uh, uh, I can't think of the word I'm looking for, but people look for this book because it's the first Clayton Crane cover in the series. Uh, so that adds value, apparently. This book, people want as much as 40 bucks for this book. And if you're patient, like I was, I think I found this for like $8. So, yeah. And um, this is <laughs> Weed Magic number one. This is an homage to the uh, Adam Hughes Supergirl cover. Really kind of cool. I had to grab that for sure. Um, what if the Tomb of Dracula, this is um, like a 1 in 20 variant. And it was what if Blade turns into a full-fledged vampire. This Witchblade kind of one-shot thing. Uh, Wolfman from the Dell series, number one. Uh, Silk, number one. It's a J or, uh, Scotty Young cover. Hulk, number one. Scotty Young cover. Extreme Venomverse, Scotty Young. King Tank Girl, number four. I think this is Scotty Young. Uh, I thought this was Scotty Young, but it's not. It's just an animal variant to Silver Surfer number one. Champions, I like these uh, these um, uh, action figure cover variants. So this is Champions number five. Um, Vampironica number one, just a cover buy on that. Getting close here. Uh, I like these odd comics. I know a poor man's comics does too. Flare Adventures number one. Get the stack out of the way here. Um, Blood Pack number one. Uh, Weapon X number seven. Just like the cover on this. Another cover by Wildcats number five. This is an interesting series here. Um, Thundercats, number one, The Return, uh, number one, number two. This is what makes it interesting, is this book right here. The number three, this uh, bondage of uh, the, the female uh, cat, I can't remember her name. Um, but it, this book here can sell for $25 to $30. Uh, so if you're all looking in them dollar bins and you come across this book, you might want to pick it up. And then number four uh, and number five finishes that series. Uh, another interesting book here. This one is really interesting to me. It kind of perplexing. This is Doomsday Comics number three. What makes this important is that this is the first color story of Usagi Yojembo. So it's kind of like, um, you know, uh, Mage number six, I think it is, first color Grendel that uh, uh, 
the uh, previews magazine with the uh, back cover with the turtles and color for the first time. Those are 10, 20, $30 books. This is a $2 book. And I'm going to argue that Usagi is more uh, um, popular than Grendel. And um, so, yeah, I, I'm surprised about that, but happy to add this. Uh, Damon Storm, number one. This is a um, McFarlane cover. Dazzler, number 21, just, I don't know why I grabbed it, but I did. Um, Black Kiss, Dead Clown, number one, out of Malibu. Dirty Pair, number two, kind of a bondage cover there. Uh, G.I. Joe, Cobra, really a Punisher-esque kind of a cover here. That's why I grabbed that. Uh, Godzilla, Half Century, um, why not? <laughs> Uh, Hero Comics 2014, J. Scott Campbell. The Hobbit, number one, never owned this, so yeah, why not? Grabbed it. Uh, this, I'm sure, is Neil Adams, I think. Uh, House of Mystery, number 225. 235. Uh, I, this is, these are the I, or not I, but just fuck Fairyland. Uh, excuse my language, F Fairyland, I guess. Um, but the, the real, uh, th these are like the, there's a I Hate Fairyland and then there's the App Fairyland. So I'm trying to fill in some of these uh, uh, other ones here. So this is number 10, Scotty Young. Number nine and number eight. Uh, another James Obar book, uh, number one, North Star Presents. I think this is about a $20 book right now. All right, last stack of books here. The uh, Robot Chicken variant to Green Lantern number 29. The Scribble Knots uh, variant to Green Lantern 27. Spawn 109 newsstand. Spawn 20, 33 newsstand. 76 newsstand. 130 newsstand. Uh, 133 newsstand. This here was kind of cool. I didn't even know this existed. Ah. But this is, it must have came, yeah, it did obviously with a Best Buy movie. But this is that Jim Lee cover to Superman 205, I think it is, or 204. Um, that pairs up with that uh, Batman 608 uh, second print. But yeah, so I saw this. It was like three bucks. And I said, why not? I just grabbed it. Maybe it was five. No, it was five bucks. Um, Jenny Frizen to cover to Rudd Sonia number one. Um, like these uh, um, vertical uh, covers, this is Hulk versus Thor, Banner of War, number one alpha variant. Thundercats, number one return. I showed number one the other cover. This is the Jim Lee uh, variant to it. X-Men, Avengers, number one, uh, the Toy Biz reprint. This one here, very happy to have this one finally. Superman Action Comics 775. The reason I'm happy to have this is this is a very hard to find, at least for me, second print. I've only seen one other one in the wild, and my buddy uh, grabbed it, and he wouldn't trade me for it. <laughs> I don't blame him. Um, but yeah, second print variant. It's probably about a $30 book, but this is the first appearance of uh, the Elite and Manchester Black, but most importantly, it's the second print. Uh, Critters number three, a uh, Usagi Yojimbo cover. Early Usagi Yojimbo. Um, this I grabbed only, I don't know, I, I like the cover, um, and it's almost Art Germish to me, but it, it isn't, obviously, but it's one of these dynamic forces, and it's signed by a couple of people, so I think it was $3, so, and it's two, um, More Than Mortal, number two, it's signed by Sharon Scott and Steve Furcho, Furco, Furcho, all right, um, Max, number seven, Max, number nine, Number 10, number 11, 12, 
uh, this is like 19, I think, uh, 20, I believe this is, God, I can't even see these numbers, 19, and then to end it off with, this is probably the book I've been, I've been after this book for probably close to a year now, and, um, if anybody knows what this is, they know that it's, it's a pricey book, or can be a pricey book, um, Roz can have no problem selling for $60, uh, um, $50, $60, $70 raw, easy. Um, this is Total Eclipse number one, a Todd McFarlane cover with uh, Spawn. And like I said, and it's stupidly hard to find at a reasonable price. I broke down, I think I paid 35 bucks for this one. I'm happy to, to finally add it to the collection. I was hoping I could uh, stealth buy this, but I never see it in the wild ever. So, um, but very, very happy to have this. And that is going to be it for this uh, comic haul. So uh, this is Vin Cruz saying thank you so much for taking this journey with me. And I will talk to you soon.